How's it going everybody? Welcome back for another quick tutorial. This one, I'm going to address an issue that I found with the Rolo. Since there's no dedicated software for creating sticker files or labels, I've come up with this workaround and I'm going to work on improving it to make sure, see if I can use one software instead of two. So the first thing you do is create a document in Google Docs instead of Microsoft Word because this is free. After that, we'll take it into Adobe Reader, which is also free. So we have our doc here. And we have an idea of the label we're going to use. I'm designing this for a one and a quarter by two and a quarter, like zero, zero direct thermal label. This can also be done with a Dymo label, the same size. So enough talking. Here we go. You have it typed up. File. You're going to download it. And we're going to download it as a PDF. Once that is downloaded, it's going to open up, if you have it set up, to pop up in Adobe Reader. You can... If it does not, you just locate it on your computer and open it up in Adobe Reader. You cannot do this if you open it up in Chrome. So once we're in Adobe Reader, we're going to take a snapshot of what we want to print. Go to Edit, take a snapshot, and try to make it pretty tight. That way we don't have as much white space around the label. All right, and then we'll print Control P. I have it set up where it doesn't give me the pop up, letting me know that the snapshot worked. You should get that if you have not disabled that. So here we are with our label. If your label size is not already selected, go ahead and select it here. If you don't see the one you need, I have another video showing you how to do that. You can click on the card now. But since this is already go, all ready to go, we'll go ahead and print. All right, that looks good. I'm just gonna adjust it a little bit. See if I can get it more centered. All right, go ahead and print that one. It looks better here. I'm going to go ahead and print a couple copies of that, and I'm good to go. All right, that wraps up this video. If you have any questions, please be sure to drop them below or email us. If this video helped in any way, let us know with a like or a comment or subscribe. For any products mentioned, I will link them below in the description. Also, be sure to use the coupon code at checkout in the description. Thanks for watching.